Welcome to the month of March 2020. This is day 61 of our daily memory fast challenge. I'll share from Ephesians chapter 5 verse 26 which says, To make her holy, cleansing her with the washing of water through the word. So God expects husband in addition to loving your wife, just as Christ loves the church and gave himself up for the church. To make your wives holy, yes, it is your job as the head, head of the household, head of the marriage. It is your job to make your wife holy, okay? So, however you choose to interpret this particular verse, what I'm getting from it is if your wife is to be compared as a married woman to the way she was when she was single, as a married woman, she should be a lot better as a result of you, especially spiritually, okay? You are the head of the household as the husband. So you have to take spiritual lead in your household. It's not only when it comes to uh, serving you food or uh, doing um, chores in the house or I don't know whatever it's the areas that you regard yourself as the head it's not you, you have to be head in all things especially in the spiritual health of your household whether with your wife with your children it's not when it's Sunday is your wife waking you up or when it's time to pray is your wife waking you up honey wake up let us pray yeah, you uh, leave me this woman somebody will not rest for you every time let us pray let us pray no you as the man should take the lead and it is your duty to brush up your wife spiritually how with the word of god for some men they are very good at abusing their wives see her foolish woman what do you know you don't you don't have brain this is your brain whether not tissue paper the inside stupid woman can't you see your mates you are very foolish, you are crazy, you are mad. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. You are mixing it up. That's not how it is done. You have to use the word of God. And, you know, that your wife, you have to use the word of God to remove her. The Bible talks about cleansing her with water through the word of God. Meaning that the wife that you have, She's not perfect, okay? She has her faults. It is your duty as her husband, as her head, to modify her. So the word you speak, make sure it's the word of God. Whatever you want to see in your wife, speak it. There's power in our words. Remember, the animals or the creatures we see today, it is Adam that named them. So name your wife. Call her the most beautiful woman on earth, no matter how she looks. Use your words. Say this woman, yes, this is my wife, you are very smart, you are very intelligent, you are very humble, you are very beautiful. Use positive words from the Bible and edify her from the Bible. If you see anything that about her that needs to be you know, modified, out of love, use the word of God. Speak to her. But first of all, how can you speak to her if you yourself, you don't know the word of God for yourself? That's why I keep encouraging us. Read the Bible every day. At least even if it's just one verse, meditate on it. Memorize at least one verse a day, okay? And God will continue to uplift you. I hope, to, I hope we can continue on this subject tomorrow. I don't want to take too much time today. Have a wonderful night and see you on day 62. Good night. Bye.